Andrus, this wasn't the plan. You said no one would get hurt. I would have said anything if it meant you deliver the box to me fully charged. Hate to break it to you, kiddo, but you've been duped. But... but... Marmar, what's he talking about? Yeah, what plan? He promised he'd take us with him to the new worlds that, that we could have amazing adventures just like this one forever and ever. Yeah, well, I don't want the cab to stink of fish. But why? Why, indeed. Enough lies, Marmar. If you don't tell them the truth, I will. You, you wouldn't. Marcy, what's going on? Did it ever occur to you, Anne, Sasha, that one of you knew more than she was letting on? That one of you might have gotten you stranded in Amphibia. On purpose. You've got to be kidding me. No, it can't be. Oops, looks like I spilled the tea, as you kids say. <laughs> I did it for us. The day we left, your birthday, they told me my dad got a new job out of state. They're making me move away. They were going to tear us apart. Now who needs the fire service? Bella's Cafe. Mercy. I, I found the box. I had no idea that it would actually work, but it did. And, and it sent us to a place where we'd never have to grow apart, where the three of us could be friends forever together. Gorg are not the takers. How could you? I've been missing my parents, my life. But look at how much fun we've had. Look at how much you both grown. Look at Sprig, I gave you this. I gave you everything. I just didn't want to be alone. Jeremiah, Abigail, Eugene.